what's up everyone hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing video with uh, Big Daddy well that was not so much about him and unboxing the the Behringer Nox 303 I'm new to this and I'm pretty much new but anyways I uh, got it on Wednesday and also got a microphone here yesterday for it which I'm gonna be talking about here in a little bit because I have problems that I also wanna be well actually need some help for um, anyways when I got it I uh, first off didn't know how to turn on the sound and get it working with, uh, with the sound and so on and like, like I said I'm new to this and this Behringer Nox 303 is probably a little bit too overkill for me but I kind of like oh it's on sale oh it looks pretty I need to get that um, so I went ahead and, and, and bought it um, which actually also turns into a disaster in, in a way because I cannot figure out the freaking manual because it's based on um, from 200, Nox 202 to Nox 1010 and uh, I actually have the manual right here next to me um, see if you guys can see that that's uh, the manual saying uh, the whole series on top and when going through it and trying to figure out how the microphone works it's gonna say find number one and you're looking for number one on the fucking page and try, trying to figure out where the hell is AUX trying to find it, cannot find it, cannot get it to work also trying to click on the, the mic I'm just gonna turn it on, here we go also used, um, well, turned on the microphone and see if I could get any sound out of it I also, well, I have it set to my uh, little radio station whatsoever with some um, speakers connected so I can hear if those coming in a voice or sound out of and um, cannot get it working and I know the the back of it is phantom power and uh, well, when, when I first heard the, the word from uh, Jerry phantom power that was like it's a Jerry aka Bonnie Killers uh, phantom power was like what the hell is phantom power and why should should I need that and it actually turns out I need to have some phantom power to use the microphone as I said I'm new to this um, and it's not like, hey, it's DJ, oh, it's DJ Wedgebeat, he must know a lot about music and so on. Yeah, I do, but not so much about mixers. Um, yeah, anyways, you can probably hear me, I'm a little bit hyper, drunk, like three or four cups of coffee this morning. Um, so, so I am a little bit like hype. Um, see what else? Yeah, it, I basically need help. Need, need help with this. Uh, I can get the audio working with uh, from the game uh, from my computer, which is uh, some of you already know, and uh, most of you that know. To uh, this computer, which is uh, streaming and doing whatever gameplay, uh, capturing and for the live stream and so on. Um, but anyways, need some help. Pretty much. Someone who knows about the Behringer Nox 300 and know how to uh, get the microphone working with um, what was it X uh, the SE uh, Electronic X1 and that's the microphone that I bought with a uh, pop filter and a oh, I can't remember what that arm, that arm is called but it was a bundle on uh, Four Sound DK which I also got the amplifier from and um, yeah. That's uh, that's about it. I actually uh, talked with uh, one of the um, one of the guys on there, and, and he also helped me out to to find uh, well, some of the products that I need. He, he suggested some other uh, mix amps. I uh, should probably have to listen to him, but I fall a little bit in love with uh, with the design of it. Just looks awesome. So I was like, well, need to get that. And as as I said, I'm new to this, so it's probably a little bit overkill for what I'm going to be using it for and I also know Behringer for some people are saying it's like a low quality product compared to other mix and but it was cheap and on sale and I was like well what the hell let us let, let us get it um, so yeah so if there is some of you out there that's making music and know about this product, product please help me uh, to get the microphone working um, I'm, if, if, if there was not, then I might actually just go ahead and buy a, I believe it's called a Phantom Power adapter to the microphone and then go from a, from a XLR to um, jack stick, normal jack, and then after that uh, from normal jack to a mini jack and then plug it into a uh, analog, oh, analog cables that I have right here. So hopefully I can get that working with just the channels here. So um, yeah. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed my video and uh, 
didn't get too annoyed by my hyperness. So uh, if you like, comment, favorite, subscribe, and please help. See you guys in the next one. <laughs>